Hey, it's Mitzi Pollock here, your candidate for city council at large, group three, and I'm out here at the port of Talleran. Um, now, the port of Jacksonville goes about 21 miles from the point of the opening that I've just passed the jetties all the way down here to downtown about where we are. And we just finished doing some petitioning and talking to some international longshoremen, which are port workers right here within the port. And I just want to stop just to remind folks how important the port is to Jacksonville and its economic growth being one of the key solutions for us here locally. You know, just alone, the port generate over $25 billion throughout the state. Now, here locally, we see about $1.8 million in tax revenue alone. It's uh, somewhere right around $169 million just was collected in taxes. Now, what does this mean as it relates to a solution? The more port jobs that we have, the better household incomes or living wages exist, which makes our city have more economic buying power. For example, the average medium income uh, for a household in Jacksonville is around 38000 But port-related jobs generate somewhere upwards of about uh, 58000 as it relates for a household income. So as you can see, one of the ways of economic empowerment or growth in this city is the port. And it's important that you have good council members there to make sure that things related to the port continue to have progress. And that's how I would bring solutions dealing with the issues. This is Missy Pollock, your candidate for City Council at Large, Group 3.